Hi folks, and uh, welcome to today's episode of Tableau in 2 Minutes. Today we're going to be talking a little bit about how you work with Excel files. Obviously Excel is one of the most common formats that we get data shared in, particularly in a corporate environment. So knowing how to work with them and how they behave in Tableau is uh, very helpful. So I've gone ahead and opened one in OpenOffice here. This is the, uh, the sample Superstore data, which we've used for a, a bunch of videos. But I want to see how it's laid out when you look at it in Excel. And obviously we have this main tab with our data on it, the, the majority of our data. But we also have two supplementary tabs, one called returns, identifying whether an order was returned, and one identifying people who are responsible for a certain region. So with all that in mind, let's go ahead and jump into Tableau and connect to that file. It is right there. And you can see that instead of having different tabs in an Excel file, we actually have different sheets labeled within our data connection here. So we're connected to this workbook and, and Tableau is treating the workbook a little bit like a database and it's showing each of the individual sheets as a different table. So what we can do is we can drag these out and we can connect them together. See this is connected on region and then we can drag out our returns as well. Our returns should be connected on the order ID. There it is. Um, so we can actually combine all these three sheets from our Excel workbook in Tableau, which can actually save you a lot of time rearranging data and using VLOOKUPs and things like that um, actually in uh, Excel itself. So with that, uh, that about does it for this episode of Tableau in two minutes. Uh, we could also recommend that you look at the uh, data interpreter video that will show you how to use the data interpreter if your uh, data in your Excel workbook is not quite as clean as it might otherwise be. Uh, but otherwise, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like what you hear and you'd like more Tableau tips and tricks, then please subscribe to our channel and we will see you next time.